Hi everyone. I'm today going. I'm going to be doing an unboxing and just gonna test it around. I just got it from eBay for around seventy bucks, I guess. And I hope you enjoy this video. And I'm sorry for if anything goes wrong, like camera plug and blur and stuff like that. So yeah, this is my first time vlogging like this. Oh, damn. Right. What you will get in the box is exactly this only this whole thing. But the only difference is that in some of this box, it show like the switches sign on there. This side is with circle, and another side with just dash. But when I just open this box, what you will actually see is just I just open up the package gym and just don't haven't tested out yet. What you get is only this. So what I was talking was like this. Okay, let me show you guys here. So uh, yeah, this is what you are really get. So just I will teach you how to use this for starters, and I will I will give you some guides for where to mount and how to mount it and stuff like that. So enjoy this. So and for today, and I'm going to be using this 2007 Nissan L Ground E51. With an Autec body kit, yeah. I'm um, sorry, guys. At first, like it was some some kind of mistake. Real, I'm sorry. Then this is a 2007 Nissan L Grand with Autec body kit, but for normal L L L Grand, I guess it's supposed to be pronounced that way. They don't have like this kind of size front and the spoiler, the side parts, the side parts here. And also for the back, there's no this and there's no this. But I think this is called like some kind of something. But I don't know. But this is got to be. I think it's. But correct me if I'm wrong. In the in the comment section, I think this is called the rear and the spoiler or something, right? I don't know. But these are the fake air vents anyway. But anyway, just neglecting this. I'm going to be using this car for today to show you guys how to and uh, what to what the just to use this. Simply just tap this here because I I, I can I can tap this tap tap that button because as you guys can see this is yeah this is something like yeah because it's this car is got an intelligent key system which you which allow you to unlock and lock and start the engine and stop the engine because like as you know these day tips are much easier to get inside your cars yeah and unfortunately this car's top speed is 190 km per hour but for some L Grand models for 2005, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 models I guess some of these have about 250 kilometers per hour around but i've seen some of these with 250 kilometers per hour in japan and some somewhere else like that yeah and for the mounting system i would suggest you oh yeah and by the way before i show you how to use this and this is the key this key looks pretty similar to a nissan gtr and like uh yeah, but it's just a little bit of difference and for the startup, it will be something like this All you have to do is just push it in and just turn just like the traditional key that you You usually use and all you have to do is just like this. I'll show you. Just give me a sec oh. First you push it and when you hear this thing this beep and you'll see this green key, but if you but if you don't have the key very near to you, it will light up red instead of green, indicating you that you need a key to start up the car. But at those times, you can start up or just put it to ACC on or start. But for now, yeah, let's start this game. Yes. All right. So, um, firstly, you might want to think that you want, you might, want to 
put it down there or up here but I can't use this top here because it's been how should I call it yeah it's been vinyl wrapped with black yeah it's for protecting the sun getting sun heat inside the car and stuff like that and also this thing which is also really nice one this button is for changing the modes and this product has about in total there are eight lights eight led lights and and i've seen some youtubers saying that they have issues with this like the wire problem like these wire problems and this secret like the tape problems and the led problems because some people buy stuff which are usually getting cheaper and cheaper like for example this product costs 23 bucks but they bought this for 10 or 9 bucks which means that it's been pretty used and it's about to be broken and yeah so um firstly for all right guys um this is another part and now i'll be showing you how to be using this firstly you put it on the secret lighter you see this tip and this tip on the top just a lighter for this car i'm just doing like this first of all you will do like this next before you mount it up you test it so that like you don't get fooled by some people like you usually get all right so just simply just put it into acc and you'll see this okay so this is what, what you are most likely to be seeing see that yeah and press this button once press this once it's just blinking at the same time with slow speed hit another time yeah it's getting faster and press it again Let's go back to first mode so um the first thing that i want to teach you first before you use this is yeah if you're a first time user like me um it literally just took me 15 minutes to figure out how to use this and i've been i've been searching for some youtube videos on how to use this product but i just found a few videos but they are different ones so i kind of get confused easily and as I was showing at first, this is the one. This is the mode with on. Oh wait, let me check again. Let me make a mistake again, I guess. Yes, this one will be for the on. And this is off. On, off. Okay, so before I... So before you mount this, before just plug in this this secret tip I would suggest you to mount it on the car first like this only then after that you just connect it to your lighter but for some cars they have got the front defrost in here as well so like yeah, if you have like something like this I would suggest you to put up here up here or maybe higher up here but for my car like this this top is being like black also I think it will work either so yeah let me show you how this works for me I just simply just mount it around like first is sorry I guess this is correct I oh, know this thing is going a little bit too high so firstly you have to adjust it for how much you have to oh, damn oh. And make sure you use both hands because this thing is not that easy like you might think. Ah, damn. Alright. This just one up here. And yeah, you just adjust it on your own, do your own personalization. You you can also use it about here or you can put it on the side like, like this side on the this side. But if you want to do like a real cop mode, I suggest you to buy three of these. But this one is red and blue version and you are yeah for this side you should buy the blue blue led lights and that's why we red red led light so now i will demonstrate you how to use this first of all you might get something like this or maybe a different tip but it doesn't matter actually 
after I just watch after a few videos like I really just watch everything so yeah and yeah I guess I'm doing this correctly again man just straight forward putting the keys turn it once and this is what what you're most likely to get it so yeah this is the first mode that I was talking to FS yeah this is the first first mode and hit this button once and what what you are see is going to be something like this and this is what you are going to be seeing for now and this is the second mode this is the second mode okay and the third mode will be like this just hit this button again and this is what you are going to be seeing this is the third mode and it's the last mode some people might guess like I might have more modes on this this product but no not like some other products but the cool feature for this thing and the best thing about this is this product will not work and unless and if the battery and the motor is off or should I just say en engine for some cars this product will not work but some other products will keep lighting on all the time even though the engine is off and the and the and sorry guys for at first like this my phone is just got cramped up yeah and as i was telling you this this product will not work unless the unless the mode is on acc i, I will show right now i will show what mode is in right now this is what i was talking about oh, give me a sec okay? so um if you are oh, wait a sec it's it's kind of written like numbers in here okay? yeah if you're in log just look at this it's not working at all but at least you need to be in but at least you need to be in acc like here just push it once and just turn it a little bit but if you're using a uh, and you'll see here see that okay so what i want to tell to you guys was like if you are using the keyless entry like push that button start don't hit the brake, just tap the button once, that's, and you start the button once only, and see if there's any change. But for some cars, like it might not work because if you're using a Subaru BLZ or Toyota GTA 6, also known as the Sign FRS, which is now the dead brand, you might have to use only the clutch if it's for manual transmission. But yeah just be just find your own way out yeah and okay so um I, I will teach you how to use this these suction cups i think I, wait a sec sorry guys um all right sorry guys for my mistake ah oh, i'm got So um, as I was talking earlier, these suction cuts are being used for to hold this, to hold this, hold to hold this LED lights, and uh, I I just bought it a few days ago and still don't have any problems at all, no issues. But I hope I don't get any issues and can I can I wish I could use this for a year or two. Because this thing costs about like 17 bucks so I don't want to waste my money just for this because it might last only for about a few days or a few weeks and then BAM the, the wire is on fire the control box below here is on fire and things are on fire so it's not like a good product anymore but some people are having pr issues already and uh, yeah um, I might put the product link in the description below and thank you guys for watching my video and sorry for my mistakes that I make bunch of mistakes in here since my phone is since my phone storage has got all the way up to the full so like yeah the video gets cut every time I I try to record anyway thank you guys for watching
and see you guys later.